Oh, I didn't see you there. You know, I've been thinking a lot about home recording lately, and I think, I really think that people's songs could benefit from a few of, a few of my favorite tips. Let's jump right in. I find the best practice is to use the longest cable available to you. Sounds great, doesn't it? If your vocalist is feeling uncomfortable, remember, everybody sounds their best in the shower. You can always compensate for poor microphone placement with more gain. Tip. If you're having trouble getting the vocals to sit right, just fix them in post. If you're having trouble with vocal compression, and I know you are, the pros always just use presets. And doesn't that sound much better? If you're having trouble getting those vocals to really sit in the mix, you can always just mute the guitars. Doesn't that sound much better? Remember kids, you can never use too much reverb. Serious talk here guys. I want to discuss a very controversial subject, and that is hi-hat placement. Now, some people say you should put it on the left side, so it's like you're watching the drummer from over his shoulder. Some people say you should put it on the right side, so it's like you're watching the drummer perform. Well, I got a real idea for you. Auto pan. That way you get the best of both worlds, baby. Bro tip. If you're still having trouble getting the hi-hats to sit correctly, just fix them in post. If you want to make your life easier when you're heading into mastering, there's one trick that you can really rely on. You want to see those red lights just lighten up. Look at that. You got some nice digital clipping going on there. You're just cutting down transients. It's great. It just means there's less to cut off in mastering, which means you can make it louder. It's all digital anyway. It's not like we're recording the tape here. Sounds great. Speaking of mastering, never be afraid to really get into those limiters. And I mean, just crank that bad boy up. Hell, one isn't enough, may as well add a second one. Or a third, or a fourth, or a fifth. Really, there's no wrong answers here, guys. We want to make this as loud as possible. Now, doesn't that sound better? Bro tip. The track still doesn't sound like you want it. Just fix it in post. And if all else fails, don't forget, you can always just start a YouTube channel and teach people how to record and mix music. Speaking of which, why don't you subscribe to my channel now for more recording tips and tricks and wait a second, is that why you have me start this f***ing channel? La, 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 la.